Hey, Curb Observers. It's a beautiful day. Going to go do some trash picking in the richest section of the richest town in New Jersey, Princeton. Um, I expect to find a lot of good stuff. Um, but I think I'm going to stick out a little bit wearing a t-shirt and jeans. So I think I need to dress up a little bit. I don't make people around there uncomfortable. Good evening. I am Professor Arthur Adeco. I am the professor of the history of the bow tie at Princeton University. Character up, I need to learn a little bit about the history of the bow tie. So I looked it up on Wikipedia. Um, one description was um, to its devotees, the bow tie suggests iconoclasm of an old world sort, a fusty adherence to a contrarian point of view. The bow tie hints at intellectualism real or feigned, and sometimes suggests technical acumen, perhaps because it is so hard to tie. This thing is hard to tie. If you're interested in this majestic structure on the right, you can have it for $3.75 million. One fascinating thing about the bow tie is that it originated among Croatian mercenaries among the Thirty Years' War of the 17th century. Hmm. They used to use it as a scarf around their neck to hold their sh the opening of their shirts closed. Man, do these people throw anything out? Yeah, I gotta give it to these folks. It doesn't look like they throw out a lot of bulk items. Um, they're not very wasteful around here. These modest tones. Yeah, I see something peeking out here. Ah, whatever, it's free. I'll swing by here and pick it up. Well, how do you like them apples? It's a play set for kids. It's wooden. Cool. I'll just throw it in the back. Buffalo Jackson Trading Company says of bow ties. Emerging from the rich and varied history of the bow tie, those who do it make a quiet, confident statement of style and class. Let your bow tie do the talking. There's no need to shout about it. That's the fish. That's right. More piles of garbage bags. Where's all the bulk in this town? Cyclists. Give them three feet, and you can cross the yellow line. It's New Jersey law. All right, I'm going to go on the other side of town and see if they have anything. Maybe I'll have some luck over there. It's a nice busy start. <laughs> All right. Oh, it's a trek. I'm totally grabbing it. To Sweet. Check this thing out. That bike is in really rough shape, but I'm, I think I can get it back on the road. Possibly get some money out of it. Jackpot, there's more stuff. Oh, that's cool. It's a drill press stand, so I can just use like a regular drill and it turns it into a drill press. 
And there's, the, oh, okay, there's like this basket. That's not bad. How about them apples? Well, I think that was a success. I wanna go get some food, I'm hungry. And Chipotle, class it up a little bit. You have to ask yourself, yes, but is it classy? I love Chipotle. Say it to them. I love Chipotle. <laughs> Hashtag not an ad. So I'm not totally upset about my haul today. I forgot to catch that on a uh, video. I totally biffed that. This thing's practically new. Uh, it works. Um, the homeowner saw me and told me that it just wasn't strong enough for them. Now this find, now this is a really good find. It's in terrible condition. Um, it looks like it's been sitting outside. The brakes are broken, rear wheel won't move. But I think I can get it on the road and sell it for you know a few dollars. Um, I wanna do something with this. Um, maybe some more content, some bicycle content. Um, just uh, keep a lookout. about Chipotle. The sauce is very delicious. The cheese, I, I don't know why I like it. I think it's good. Their tortillas are really good. The chicken is much better than Qdoba. Better than, um, yeah, Pancheros. Moe's doesn't even like, Moe's is like, the it's the chevy malibu this is the chevy spark of burrito places <laughs> where we'll say chipotle is like like a toyota forerunner like trd pro you know <laughs> yeah. it's attainable like it's not, you know, a Lamborghini Urus, you know, yeah. or it's not a Tesla truck. I could actually buy one. It's like or a toy a ride. Kia. Yeah, it's like a, <laughs> it's like a toy ride. Everybody hypes that shit up, <laughs> but, but it's like, it's gross. Mm. <laughs> You can taste the chemicals. You can taste the chemicals. <laughs> the only thing, the only thing that Kudoba has going for it is they have Cholula. Mm. <laughs> Cholula hot sauce. Cholula hot sauce.